I know it's not displaying yet. Give me one moment. Active border scrolling. Animation speed. Text size. Let's bump that up a bit. Um, stop with the judge. judge. <laughs> I thought it was Spanish. Uh, ja ja is Argentina. Chat, how do you feel about me switching? Not, I'm not. I'm gonna do some War Tales today, but I was thinking I could do like an hour and a half of War Tales, and um, I kind of want to do a little bit of Stalker. What do y'all feel about that? How do you feel about that? Ronaldinho soccer. I dislike that culture. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, I understand what you're saying, but out of context, it's really funny. I can handle stalker if the bitrate can. Oh, that's a good point, actually. Let me do a quick recap. Um, when last we left our adventures, um, things were actually kind of turning around. Last time. They were actually kind of um, getting better. Um, I still was running out of money. Um, I don't know. Why do you want me to... See, this is the weird thing about War Tales. Uh, I don't know. Poor. Um, I, I have no money, but everyone's cured right now. So that's really good. Um, I believe I have one more medicine. Is that medicine? Yeah, cure for plague. I, I bought one more because we're going to go to um, Mount Altus Tower, location defended. Mm, missing woodcutters. Interesting. Well, um, I'm pretty sure... Is it like around here? that um imatan is the broker's tale who is the broker's tale oh i see bring bring the required goods to the merchant we're gonna go east um and we're gonna try and find imatan stalker will be nice people are okay with stalker Yeah, um, so we're poor, but we're not, like, sick. That's the good news. Um, I've been really struggling with this game. It has, it, it's, it's kind of a difficult game. Maybe I'm just bad at it, but, like, it's also pretty difficult, so. I heard the other day, none of your business. I heard that this show on Netflix got canceled called, um, Warrior Nun. And people are kind of in an uproar about it. But what a funny show to, like, kind of want to fight those guys. If we fight those guys, we have two shackles. We could potentially make some money here. Two hoodlums, one poacher, one marauder. Uh, don't worry, I saved recently, so. Netflix canceled Inside Job, really? And Final Space? They, um, one of my favorite shows, uh, on Netflix ever was Dirk Gently. And when they canceled that, it, that was when I began to lose a lot of my, like, I want, you know, faith in them and their, you know, ability to make these kind of decisions. I, uh, I, I just like, I really liked that show and that was... That was when I started to just, like, get kind of fed up. I can't remember. There were other shows before that that they canceled that I really liked. But, um, yeah, Holistic Agency. You did not know that that was a TV series? Neville, I highly recommend it. It's really good. And it has, um, the guy who plays Dirk is is actually really good. He's he's kind of, um, I didn't know what to make of him in the first episode, but he's he's very well done. And his um, backup is Elijah Wood. <laughs> and he's perfect. I love him so much. Um, Elijah Wood kind of plays a jerk. I won't I won't lie. He's, he plays kind of a jerk. And, uh, and I like him. 
as that. Um, all right, so yeah, we get the combat from that. We're gonna go ahead and continue. Phineas and Ferb is reportedly getting two more seasons on Disney Plus. Um, if I, I wonder if I use this, does that count? Like that? Does that? Did they get an attack of opportunity on that? I wonder. Well, whatever. Uh, we're gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and use this. <clears throat> I'm hoping someone else will come up to, to her, to, to Mimi. Nope, never mind. I'm, like, very bad at this game. Anyone watch The Last of Us Episode 1? No. Chat, uh, what do you all think of The Last of Us? Like, what is, uh, what is our, like, what's, what's everyone's uh, opinion on The Last of Us? I've got opinions. Um, to which I, most of them are like very poorly informed because, um, you know, the fact of the matter is I don't, I haven't played the games and I have not, um, watched anything about it. I haven't watched any YouTube series about it. Um, I haven't watched a dang thing about it, but, but, but I do have opinions, <laughs> Hey, I just realized we're supposed to be um, beating these guys up. Not, sorry, not beating them up, but like taking them prisoner. So I'm going to try and do that. Um, I, I'm going to let Mimi beat this guy up. Can I reach this guy? No, I can't. Damn it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go over here and hopefully Mimi won't won't uh, beat up Granoff, but I'm hoping that the Sulum does not uh, get an attack off on uh, Mimi. And um, Nevelina unfortunately um, is stuck in the mud. It's big here in Brazil. People love the game and love the episode. Uh, never played the game or watched the TV show. My opinion on the game is neutral on the TV show is positive. I haven't played the games also. Kind of scared to watch ever since the Walking Dead game. What do you mean by that? That's a weird way of putting that. I mean, like, the, the, the Telltale game? Um... Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna charge through this guy. Wait, actually, yeah, I'm gonna charge through this guy, and I'm gonna taunt him, and hopefully, that's enough that I should be able to uh, knock him out in the next uh, phase. Can I knock him out? Let's do a destabilizing strike. That's eleven to thirteen. That should bring him down to below half. Oh my god, that's perfect. Yo, it's like catching a Pokemon. <laughs> Success rate 100%. He was at one health. That's incredible. All right, I'm going to run him over here so we can start getting some stuff over here. Also going to do... Oh, we don't have... Um. Okay, never mind. Cactus um, is in combat gonna let's just not hit this guy and uh they'll do an encouragement we should be able to make some pretty good money here um don't know anything about it either people in brazil love the games a lot so the tv show is great as well it's a strange PC port. I know some games have a specific gameplay, but only one button and that button pauses the game. It's just plain old weird. I don't get it. The only video game centric movies that I knew nothing about before watching was Uncharted. Freaking ISPs. What? Felt like Indiana Jones, but not. That's uh, That was what I thought. I, I haven't seen it, but... I, you know, um, what's his name? Tom something. The guy who played new Spider-Man. <laughs> he is such a weird, like, 
I, I like him as a person and as an actor, maybe, but he just has a knack of getting these acting jobs that I really don't care for at all. Tom Holland, yeah, that's it. Bimple didn't get the joke at all. You're right, I didn't. I'm sorry. Can you explain it to poor Bimple Brain? Oh no! That's not good. That means I'm gonna have to engage with that guy again uh, in order to try and knock him out. The good news is um, I have like two two people get a turn. So what I'm gonna do is actually I'm gonna engage with I'm gonna engage with Cactus. Makes sense because I get some extra points for that. Luckily, um, we did not. Uh, he did not crit him. I'm trying. I'm trying to capture these guys. So this is an 83% chance. There we go. Actually, gonna run back. Mm. I think I get extra valor for this. Yeah. And I'm gonna come over, and we should be able to do some pretty good damage against him. And we're gonna, I'm going to use up as much Valor as possible because I have a ton of disposable Valor right now. Um, I'm not going to be able to reach him. I'll walk over, but there's like really no point. One damage. Nice. Played and watched some gameplay of the Walking Dead game on Xbox. And, and since I think I have had my fill of zombie things, but The Last of Us still kind of piques my interest. Well, they're, see, they're not zombies in uh, The Last of Us. They're actually freakers. What was that game where, like, the, the the people who are, like, managing it were, like, contractually obligated to, you know, remind everyone that they, they were not, in fact, zombies. They were freakers. I bet no one knows what I'm talking about. I think the game is, like, largely forgotten now. You have 85 pay wages to pay. What an odd time to tell me that. I still can't reach him. I created a wall that he can't get past. I should be able to kill him with the uh, grand off. I could have probably uh, captured this guy as well, but I only have the two chains. I called New Last of Us a PC port because Sony games are basically movies. One button is to pause the show. That's really good. Outlaw's Tunic. I bet you that's actually pretty good for someone. So, I, I, everyone like could use better armor, basically. Okay, repair all. Um, these two being injured is actually fine. I'm right next to the prison, so this is actually amazing. Um, poor Lay leveled up, which is great. He's level four. One more level and he gets a new special ability. Increases the skill-based damage on dexterity and critical hits. This seems like it would be a good thing to have. Um, he's got enough crit. I'm going to go ahead and use some, uh, some of my, uh, influence to increase his dexterity. Hope you all have a good... Stream. Oh, are you taking off? Not very feeling very social today, so I'm gonna lurk. Okay, take it easy. I'm at ten. I'm late to stream. Has it already been brought up that Justin Roiland has been arrested for felony, felony domestic abuse, and false imprisonment, and his game company has been sued for harassment? Uh, I didn't know that second part, but um, it hasn't been brought up yet. It has now been brought up. Thoughts? Thoughts in chat? I'm not talking about, like, uh, the ones you have in your head. I'm, I'm asking the thoughts what they think. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, I'd rather talk about the game Bimple is playing. I mean, that's fair. Just to avoid drama. But it, drama is so, it's so juicy. Oh, man. We can, uh, we can get back, like, our suspicion if we do this, so we should go rob some stuff before we hand in the hoodlums. 
They're worth 65 each. That's actually pretty good pay. Uh, and I'm gonna buy two more of these chains. This is this is actually paying the bills right now. Like literally paying the bills. Um. Okay. The harassment charges are actually from like 2019. They were swept under the rug and it happened. Oh. What what a rant about it. Uh, Andrino, I had an awful day yesterday, so I'm in need of social stuff. What, uh, what's, what's, uh, what's, I mean, you don't have to talk about it. In fact, probably you want to not talk about it, so let's not talk about it. Um, tell you what, I'm not going to talk about the, uh, I'm not going to talk about Justin Roiland specifically. I'm going to talk about Rick and Morty <laughs> for a moment and how annoying it is. Uh, not the show. Uh, we've talked about Rick and Morty before. Um, but here, let me, let me explain a couple of things. Um, it's really frustrating having been any kind of fan of the show because now, um, I, I just like the, the absolute worst people are like advocating for this show. And also, it's, I won't, I'm not going to lie, the people who, like, hate on it as a personality are also kind of getting on my nerves a little bit. Because, like, come on. <laughs> like, to deny that the show, at, like, had, you know, any quality or, or value at all is, like, I, I think just, like, you know, it, it's not, oh, my God, I have no food. I have zero food. Well, this isn't going to work out. I need to get some food. Uh, okay, we need to pull two people off of the camp. Because that's hopefully going to improve our happiness. So it reduces daily food consumption by two. Okay, so that's actually, we need him on there. If you rest now, your troop will be unhappy. Insufficient food. Damn it. Uh, I need more food. I don't know why I left the... I guess I had no money. That's That was why. So. I'm going to talk about Rick and Morty. Boo and how bad it is. Yay, not the show. Boo the fans. Yay and the haters. Well, now he's just attacking me personally. You hate the show, uh, Kevbo? I'm not saying you're, like not allowed to hate the show you're da absolutely allowed to hate the show i just think that it's like it's the people who are like the show was never good it was always garbage and it was always like you know i'm just like you know it's let me let me let me play a, a victim card for a moment um it's really hard to find any kind of sci-fi that at least i personally like um, sci-fi is one of those things that gets killed, like, immediately. Um, and, uh, if you don't believe, if you don't believe me, just kind of look at what's going on with Star Trek right now. It's, it's a mess. Uh, I, I don't think you're supposed to like most of the characters in Rick and Morty. But that's not why I watch the show. I don't watch the show because I think that Rick is a smart bean or whatever, you know, garbage. I watch the show because it has some genuinely good sci-fi concepts, and I enjoy that. Uh, drink to forget Re requires beer. Um, I can feel it inside of me. The illness will take over. As soon as I run out of meat, I will go mad. I've seen it happen to the infected. It will not end this way. Uh, you are cured, though. I cured you. Curl up into a ball and cry. Suggested by Cactus. I've always thought this show was massively overhyped by the super annoying fans. Royal and sense of comedy humor wears thin for me really fast. That's fair. Jerry? Are you supposed to like Jerry? I don't know if anyone likes Jerry. I judge the show by its entirely... 
uh, as a f social phenomenon, so no, a show with a bad fandom cannot be good because it does not make me happy. And that's interesting. That's an interesting take. I mean, that's unfortunate because it basically means that anything that is like popular cannot necessarily be enjoyed as much. And I don't, I, I know that's a, that's a weird way of saying that, but like anything that becomes popular enough is going to have annoying fans. There's no way around it. Who owns Granoff? I don't think anyone does. I think Kevbo, maybe. Jerry Option? You guys want... You you want him to crawl... Honestly, that is better for us in some ways. Um, that... L that's... That lack in happiness is really bad. Um, we basically lose our maximum valor points. I would never own another person legally. <laughs> Fixed. I vote heal. The problem with that is it uses my last cure for the plague, and that was um I own I have that specifically to cure Imatan. But yeah, alright. I I can I, I guess I can buy another one. We have some money now. Um, yeah, that's brutal. We did... We didn't lose too much happiness. Anything... Any game above 15 grants you 5, uh, influence. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna head back to Storm Cap. Strom Cap. Heels are always more entertaining than faces. Wrestling joke. I totally get what you're saying. Mimi does draw, but no coffee for me. Uh, are you on tea then? What's your tea? Fanny joke. Forever tea. Okay, um, I'm gonna see if I, there's any food I can buy. Haha, <laughs> funny duck. Uh, price reduced, temporarily reduced. Well, this isn't really what I want. I want, I want that meats. I can't cook any of this. <laughs> Y'all need to start selling food that I can actually cook. God damn. Interest. Uh, the only reason I haven't sold this is because it's worth 50 here. I can only imagine what it's worth in Salazar. Uh, we have this outlaw tunic. I'm going to see if anyone, if that's an improvement for anyone. Uh, no for Cactus. No for Mimi. Yes for Parlay. So now we have this doublet. Uh, and now I have to sell the doublet. Okay. I agree to buy his wares and sell them here in his name. However, I require proof that he can hold up his end of the bargain. I believe the exquisite Marheim commodity everyone's talking about will do the trick. Okay. That's for a quest. Um, do I still, do I have an apothecarist? I don't. That's fine. Is there any point to mint? Uh, I can sell this mint and I can sell this comfrey. I do want to have an apothecarist again at some point, but like it's, it's not working right now. Cure for the plague. Man, that's expensive. 60 coin. I'm going to just sell all my comfrey and mint for now. And I guess snow iris. I, I have enough to make medicine, but it's like, uh, you know, I, I can't, weirdly, I cannot really afford to make medicine. Like I have the stuff. I guess I should have just made medicine. Who would have been an apothecarist? I guess Nevelina could have been an apothecarist. I could steal it back. Oh, we could steal some medicine. You know what? Let's do that. I'm going to get into stealing. I'm tired of this being poor business. Being poor is for the birds. 
Did you sell the mint? How will you drink mint tea? We can steal it back. That's why. That's how. All right. So, Nevelina, you are going to thieve some stuff. You can steal items using right-click. Each theft increases the guard's suspicion. Wow. That raises the suspicion by a lot. Um, teaches you how to prepare sharpening oil. Strength oil. Every time a skill deals damage, has a 30% chance to increase the strength for three rounds. So this is going to raise our, this would raise our wanted level by a full 100. So that's not worth it. Maybe I need to like, um, start small. We're going to do like a vial. I guess it was going to steal the whole, like five bottles. Uh, I didn't want to steal five bottles. I wanted to steal like one medicine. So anyway, we're not wanted. Can, is there anything I can steal here? Uh, 45. No, not really. I, I kind of wish there, there was a way to steal like only one thing. I guess it doesn't matter too much. I'm not wanted as well. No one cares. I am drinking lemongrass with a dash or two of lemon. N Nevelina cares only about smashing. No, today Nevelina also cares about um, stealing. Okay, we're off to try and find Imatan. So what's everyone drinking today? Mimesis is drinking the mint tea. No, why does Bimple never read my ambiguously consenting jokes? Kevbo, I actually don't see your message at all. I'm sick, so I've been drinking tea. Wait, Ka Galen said, my coffee is set to tea, steeped. Faces equals good guys, heels are bad guys. Heels option sounded like heels. It's a bad joke. I've actually... It actually tastes like something besides bog water now, so I, I put stevie in it instead of sugar. You're sick? Oh no. Your hilarity with shadow band? I, I turned shadow batting off, so I don't know what the deal is. I think this is where we started. Up in this mountain. Um, sorry I keep checking the map, but I'm really bad at knowing where I am. I think YouTube just still auto-blocks certain words. Is that another set of marauders that we could... Uh... Oh, yeah. Wait, those don't look like marauders. Those are like... Henchman, Raider, Bomber. Uh, the bomber is no good. Still, um, could be some good money. Did it appear in in-game chat? That's an interesting idea. So we're fighting, uh, this bomber needs to be, like, engaged as soon as possible. We have Granoff, Cactus. I think uh, Cactus could potentially reach them. Yes. So that's good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do an encouragement. Actually, no. Let's. I'm just going to run in. Nice. Um, this henchman, we could potentially do something. I'm thinking if I run in and smack him with my weakening blow, I might be able to capture that guy, like, right away. But it looks like I'm not going to be able to make it that far. So I'll just run up to this guy and hit him with both. 
both both blows. Yesterday was my GF day off and she wanted to clean the house. Thing is, I work from home, but that doesn't mean I'm doing nothing. It's called home office. It's called home office. I'm just going to stab this guy a little bit. Just to, I'm just going to do a little stabbing, Stan. Um... And then I'm going to... I'm trying to capture these guys. We're trying to capture as m many of these people as possible. In fact, there's only four of them. Um, I, if we could capture all of them, that would be ideal. So we're going to start with this guy over here who's ripe for capture. Uh, missed, apparently. So what I might do is actually taunt him. He has 14 health left. I didn't mean to do deflection. I'm going to do a destabilize. Oh, that'll potentially kill him. 11 to 13 damage. I don't understand how he is. Uh, t I guess I, I, it's because I applied weakening to him. I'm just going to I'm just going to pass for now. Now, Mimesis is kind of an issue here because, uh, you know, she doesn't know how to do small blows, you know? Oh, but what she does do know how to do is to taunt. So she's going to taunt this guy. Um, hopefully that puts him in a position to be captured later. 18 damage deals 14 damage. Okay. She can she can uh, she could do a blow like that I hope things uh, my hilarity has been shadow banned. I think YouTube still auto blocks certain words. It's fine I'm just being stupid and congested congested did it appear? Uh, anyway, she stressed me out and now is angry at me. Oof relatable. Oh, I'm sorry about that That uh, that's that's no that's no good Okay, they're not dead. This is good. Um, Nevelina is going to... No, that's not... Well, actually, Annihilation could be good. 12 to 16. Um, if it doesn't kill this guy, it would be really good. I only have a 55% chance of succeeding. So let's let's go for a chance to kill him. Damn it. Damn it. It killed him. Damn. Ugh. I need money. <laughs> I wish I could undo that. This guy's like in perfect mode. Um, I wouldn't mind, I don't know, disengaging to try and capture this guy. Mental work tires you out just as much as physical work. Mental work, um, is in some ways more exhausting. Mimi unlocked the trait instinctive. Uh, I should have used cactus to, to try and knock that guy out. I'm going to move Gran off over here. And uh, maybe I can knock the, the henchman out next round. Now this isn't good. Poor Lay is going to do what he does best and stab this guy and gain some extra valor from behind. Um, okay, so Nevelina should be able to come around and capture this guy. Eighty-three percent chance. There we go. Okay. 
and um, we'll take some extra valor to smack this guy down a bit. Mimi's comment got shouted ban. I think the censorship thing thing he got reset. What? It can't possibly. That's not an option of the channel of of like the stream. That's an option of like that's in my deep. I I I don't I don't know how to change that. If you're working in front of a computer, that still works. Only day she has uh, have this week, and she need to cl clean the house. But damn, not on my work time. <laughs> I spent nearly a year and a half making Pedro land, and I was putting in roughly seven hours a day, racking my brain trying to figure out how to make the game play good. Jesus. Yeah, I mean that that's that's hard work. Uh I might have just killed this guy for my poison. I'm going to move over here and taunt the guy and hopefully that'll mean that I can knock him out. This guy doesn't seem to be tauntable. This guy should be capturable. 11 damage to the target of fate. No, I don't want to do that. Because that'll kill him. I should be able to capture him now. And if it doesn't capture him, I'll have a, another attempt to do so. It's 67% chance. There we go. Easy peasy. I am like slowly... Um, making we're, we're gonna make some cash here for sure and also um, this is gonna bring down my my uh reputation a bit so that i can go and steal some more stuff so this is a good way of making some extra cash um unfortunately this guy doesn't really engage in combat normally i'd have to like st stand someone in front of them Maybe? I don't know. How does it work? How, how can I capture this guy? <laughs> Taunt him. It, it doesn't work. He doesn't get engaged in combat. I'm thinking maybe I let him attack Granoff and then they'll be engaged in combat. I know that's a, a weird way of doing things, but... It's the best I can come up with. I don't really want to do any more damage to him. So I'm going to let Granoff take a blow. It's only two damage. Are they in combat now? No. That's really annoying. This guy is like uncapturable. Uncapturable. How do I... I don't think I can capture him. I think, honestly, he is... Uh, he, he He's going to die free. <laughs> so, goodbye. Porlay unlocked the trait lively. Well, we got some new traits. Mimi also leveled up. Is she level 5 now? Vinland Saga match? Yeah. I love Vinland Saga. New season now, huh? It's been a while. Sixty-five and sixty-five. All the dungeons are full. What? There's a limit? My dude. I can't believe that, honestly. Ether. Leather, vile, brandy, cloth. I'm wondering if this is uh, something we can use to capture a bunch of people at once. We sold them to strangers. Well, I mean, technically this is the law. I don't know. Still a stranger, yes, but... I can't believe I can't sell this guy.
Free me. I promise I'll never steal again. Recruit him for 96. He's another, uh, he's a ranger. You got stab. You can recruit guys from here as well. I don't think that there are, I think there's a reason not to do it. Volunteer, lazy, drunkard. I mean, they've got some bad traits, first of all. So we're going to have to run around with this Sevenus for a little while. Hopefully he won't stab us in our sleep. Um, we don't have enough food, um, apparently. And I've got to make a camp. Ugh. This is, this is what happens, Larry, when you take a stranger to the Alps. I need more food. I'm going to talk to these merchants and maybe, um, maybe they have some food or maybe I can sell some stuff to them. Are you bandits? We have nothing. We are only refugees fleeing a Doranian war. Please let us go. Okay. They're not merchants. We made some money. We did make some money. Uh, I do officially need to make that, um chest uh this thing camp chest i need more iron ore for that i could go buy some and this would gain us a little bit of knowledge and okay we, we there's no way we're gonna make it to storm, storm cap i was thinking uh, if we could gain some knowledge we could learn to make the perch recipe I'm going to go, this prisoner is going to uh, uh, gain us a bit of happiness. We could also make, we'll make him the scholar. No, we can't make him the scholar. Um, yeah, the, the prisoner will make us, get us some happiness. Um, is, uh, do we seriously not have enough food? Most, must consume alcohol with every meal to be happy. Oh, that, we have a drunkard, that's why. Things are not going well in the food department. We don't have enough food. We can't turn the prisoner in. Oh no, whatever could we do? I don't have the cannibalism trait, Neville. I do not have the cannibalism trait. Okay, Mimesis is ready to level up. Um, Mimesis is still level four. Okay. At level five, we get damage inflicted to armor increased by 35%. As long as there are at least two enemies within six meters of this unit, the unit has protection. That's really cool. Uh, damage and critical hit chant increased by 20% against units with at least one debuff. I'm going to do career plans to increase her strength. I'm not sure what to do with this guy. Honestly, freeing him comes to mind. I can no longer be chosen to complete tasks. I wonder if we could just hand him in to these guys. You there, show me what you've got there. Except. What's this? Something tells me these do not belong to you. Oh, I have to return the... Well, that was... That was silly. Alright. Thank you for your contribution, but don't let this happen again. Well, that was dumb. Never talk to a cop. You know? He stumbled and fell in the pot. It's not our fault, we swear. Eh. Yeah, you know. This guy's got Legion Gambison. And uh, a Brotherhood Ulf Birth. Team Strike Skill. Deals 79% strength damage to the target. Damage increased by 50% for each adjacent ally. That seems like a really nice weapon, but I don't really have the, the means. We could steal it. 
Oh, man. If, uh, if I didn't have, um, if I had no wanted level, I would consider it. It's a really nice sword. Please save some money for his pimple. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna buy it for sure. I'm more likely to, to, to steal it. Um... I was thinking, okay, we're going to sell a couple of these bottles because I don't need them really as badly. And what I was thinking is I'm going to go and buy uh, a little bit of iron and make the um, the chest. Because that's going to allow us to sell our stolen goods. Uh, let's see, well, we're going to go to three hair market. We should be able to buy, actually, we could steal some iron. How much, how, how badly? 60 to 100. Um, this could very well put us on the wanted list. I'm gonna save first. I hope you don't mind if I save scum a little bit. Just a little bit. We're a novice thief right now. You will be wanted by the guard for this theft. Are you sure you want to proceed? No, I guess not. Is there, um, someone else should have iron because I sold it to them. This is cheaper. They're selling it at a reduced price. It says you'll be wanted, but it, it shows a range, so I'm not sure how it knows I'll be wanted. So whatever. I'll buy a little bit of this since it's actually uh, a pretty good price right now. I'm not sure how much I need. Camp chest. We're good. We have a camp chest. The sign thief laundered the items stolen during rests little by little. We don't have any uh, like stolen goods right now, so... I really like the style of this game except for the way we walk through the map. It really doesn't please me at all. I was thinking of buying Bannerlord, but gave up for the same reason. It's uh, weird how more valuable items don't necessarily increase your notoriety by a proportionate amount. But, well, I mean, I don't know. It's a, it, I think of it like it's only increasing your notoriety if you get caught, right? So there's less likelihood of you getting caught um or there's a range you know like it could be you i don't know um we need to buy some food i'll buy some more perch and oh i still don't have a freaking knowledge point damn that's enough for one day of food i really need to get on this like food situation Okay, what kind of jobs do we have we uh marheim is desperately looking for three of pottery and is ready to pay the price Did I actually take that? Why did I take that job? That was a really dumb job to take. Because I can't get to Marheim. They they want me to pay like a ridiculous amount of money to get to, to Marheim. Yeah. Hmm. I want to steal this pancake. How, how much do you think? Look at that. That's absurd. <gasps> we did it. We stole the pancake. Guys, we did it. <laughs> and, and we don't have to sell this. We can just eat it. It's the perfect crime. <laughs> it's the perfect crime. 
Um, can I make anything here while I'm at it? And then, uh, no, we can't. Damn. I'm just like, I'm not in a great position right now. I guess I need some leather. Let's, let me decide on something to make and then I'll buy some leather and then sell whatever I can. Um, I don't have enough iron. I don't have enough iron. I don't have enough iron. I need some leather for these things. Uh, I need, okay, I could make two of these, but I need leather. So I'll buy two leather. And, uh, and then I'll make two targes and then sell the targes. Should, uh, that should, this should profit a little bit. And we'll gain a little bit of knowledge as well. I, I'm very bad at this. Not bad. All right. I don't think we gained any knowledge, actually. Um, all right, so let's sell these targes. See, they sell for 20 each. That's not bad. I wonder if anyone can use them. Uh, this guy might, actually. Yeah. Um, apparently, I can I can actually use these targes. Why? Why? Uh... Yeah, poor lay can poor poor lay cannot equip a shield. Okay, that's fine. Poor um Granoff already has a shield. Uh Mimi can't use it. Bill is a pony. <laughs> Sell the other targe though. That is still technically a profit. Adventure time, Jake. The style is great. I really it really feels like journey when traveling though to me. It's really cool. I understand why it can be troublesome. I, yeah, I, like, I kind of, um, I, I like it, but I like map style games. Um, and I, I like how this kind of looks like a diorama to me. We should have enough money and food to pay everyone. I want to go and find Imatan. Oh, I should have sold this, uh, barred lid. Uh, did I go the wrong way? I guess not. We could check out that, um, oh no. <laughs> I could check out that mine. There might be, uh, something good at the mine. Always good to check the mines because they, oh, that's a sinister cave actually. No, there's still stuff here. We have lockpicks. We can open this up now. Solid. Got some XP as a thief. And look at that. Look at all the good stuff. Nice. Doesn't even count as stealing. There's nothing else here, apparently. I guess it pays to uh, rotate the camera. They're like counting on you to not rotate the camera so that chest is hidden behind that stalagmite. Sparkly loot. Indeed. Indeedy dude. So yeah, um, you guys want to talk about Stalker for a moment? Um, I've been really enjoying Stalker and I really feel like it would have made a better stream game than a recording game. Um, I am going to be playing the, uh, the game that I am like mid progress on, but you didn't miss anything. Like you really didn't. The game is very light on the story. Um, and it is an open world, you know, kind of just go and kill some mutants. Um, I don't know, like, I, like, how do I, do y'all need me to sell you on Stalker? And I'm not sure, uh, what, to how y'all feel about it. Progress made in your discoveries has earned you a knowledge point. Hey, we have a farm here. I don't think I've ever been here. Oh, is this where I find out about... Um, yeah, this is Imatan. Go away, I'm starving. I'm be begging, beginning to lose control. I might kill you. 
Uh, this is Imatan, so we're gonna we're gonna get him. Nothing to offer. Could you, could you take care of him? Recruit for five perch. Ah, why does he need so much food? He's gonna eat a full day of food for, from us. I don't know if I can afford this. Um, I wish I could inspect him. If I recruit him, I'm pretty sure I can get him cured for free because uh, there was a there there is a band of people up in the mountains that were like looking for someone who got infected. I'm going to leave and I'm going to save here. No, not load. Save. Um, this is uh, one of those things that could absolutely destroy the game, but I'm going to try it. Troop has joined. Torse has joined your troop. Your companions are happy. We're gonna go ahead and change his name right away to Imatan. I don't know why there are two eyes there. I don't know. I can't. You might need to sell me on Stalker. I don't know much about it. Okay. Um, Stalker is a kind of a fantasy or fictional. Um, dystopian world set post the events of chernobyl do you know um about chernobyl i am not uh, i would i'm not gonna judge you if you don't but um basically it was it was a, a real life event in which a nuclear reactor almost basically destroyed half of europe uh no joke and I talk about this I, i've been recording sessions on this game but i talk a little bit about it i find it very strange that were totally cool with this fictional world based on such a like weirdly wildly destructive and traumatizing event like this um i find the events of chernobyl to be fascinating but also very morbid um and uh it's it, it is interesting I, I need to talk to these guys they're the ones that are going to cure my friend maybe for free we were sent from elazar to rid the northern forest of its plague rat infestation However, we're also looking for an infected man. Apparently, Stormcap uh, cast him out. There are amongst your men. You're, that's him. That's the one. Uh, gets Purifier's ring. Hand him over. Are we about to hand him over? For a hundred? We get a hundred? I'm, I'm a ten is sold. We have gained uh, Purifier's ring. Uh, set with a... A square cut ruby, a signature item worn by purifiers. It's been some time since we had last had a live subject. Now, where did I put my kit? Sorry, guys. Um, someone else will have to be Imatan. Destroy is a bit of a strong word. You weren't allowed to eat mushrooms for years, and that's mostly it. Um, I did. I did sell Imatan. Uh, like here's the thing. Um, Chernobyl as it happened didn't almost destroy europe chernobyl as it could have happened almost destroyed europe meaning the events that happened are bad they could have been so much worse like so much genuinely worse that it's it's kind of insane um it's it's like possibly one of the worst events uh, we as a human <laughs> culture have created uh and and that really needs to be underlined more <laughs> like uh i'm not gonna get into the whole like controversy of like is you know nuclear good or bad um because like there's no point uh people are, are either on board or they're not um i think that it can be done well that's that's where i'm gonna end my kind of opinion on it but um as a whole, I, I think it's it must be like pretty much hard stake in the ground that Chernobyl is is like horribly bad, <laughs> like um, could could almost couldn't be much worse, but it it could have been, and if it had been worse, it would have it would have would have made like most of Europe uninhabitable. So um, like truly grotesque stuff. 
Uh, what does willpower do for us again? Critical hit. We're going to give that to Porlay. That's a great band for Porlay. We learned a lot from it. Nuclear fission reactors nowadays are built very different because of that event. It's true. But, um, you know, we as much as we did learn stuff from it, um, there we didn't have to. <laughs> you know, like, the thing is, is that a lot of the things that, like, yes, we did learn a lot from it. But as I understand it, um, the stuff that led to the events of Chernobyl uh, were, like, very intentionally cut corners. Um, so it's, you know, what, what are you going to do? I don't know. The reason I sold, here's why I sold I'm a Tan. I'm sorry, but it was a hundred. I just gained a hundred gold and a really valuable item. So uh, I, I'm going to find someone else to be I'm a Tan. I just think that uh, like I'm, I'm still running into food problems right now. Uh, so I'm, I'm really just trying to like get back to scratch. I'm glad it didn't turn out any worse. We're up to, we're back to 15 happiness. I actually, like, I'm not going to say starving my, my troop is a good idea, but we could skimp a little bit. As long as we have enough people at the camp, um, then, then we can, uh, we can actually make do. And I still, I do have these jewels I can sell. Luxury item. Um... It was too valuable handing uh, Imatan over. <laughs> uh, like keeping him was going to be way too, way too taxing. I thought they were going to cure him. I really thought they were going to cure him. I, I didn't think that they were just going to like take him and then experiment on him. Apparently I got to keep his stuff as well. Either way, um, Stalker is set in a fictional um, part of, of Ukraine um, in, in which Chernobyl uh, didn't just, like, lead to, uh, you know, horrible events, but it also created this, like, zone of, uh, you know, radiation, anomalies, very twisted weather events, um, mutants, zombies. Uh, zombies are not a big part, but they are a part. I'm sorry. Um, and, uh, two, basically two major factions. There's a lot of factions, but there's two major ones. There's the stalkers, which are basically people who have come to the zone seeking, um, treasure, riches, and glory. Uh, not, not so much glory, mostly just riches, uh, in the form of artifacts. Artifacts are these little jewels and stuff that, uh, are formed by the anomalies and, uh, weird environments. Um... And uh, the bandits and the bandits don't try, they don't risk themselves so much as they do uh, wait for stalkers to find these uh, artifacts and then they kill them. So bandits are bad. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sell some more stuff. Um, I don't know what I'm, I'm going to be doing next, to be honest, in terms of like, like we're selling some stuff. Um, I, I've actually got some pretty good money right now. We're actually kind of we're actually in the black uh, We have a knowledge point. I could learn how to cook perch. Hey, what does that guy have? What is this? Oh Repair. Yeah, um, don't really want to do that Taxing no taxation with our <laughs> Pimples talking about roadside picnic with stalkers and anomalies. Nice. I am talking uh, I don't know if you mi missed it, Kevbo, but um, after this, I'm going to play a little bit of uh, Stalker, the Stalker game I've been playing. The Stalker version I've been playing, by the way, is um, it's called Radiophobia, and it is a like self-contained standalone game. You can actually download it for free yourself. Um, basically, all of the Stalker games are free at this point if you know where to look. And I'm not talking about piracy. I'm talking about like. Um, there are like overhaul mods that are standalone so you can just play a version of stalker for free um, They're really good games. They are a little bit aged and that's why I wanted to look for overhaul mods because um, You know, they they add some graphical pluses and and they also add some uh, uh, quality of life features as well as some uh, You know, it, it just a, a couple of bug fixes here and there make them a bit more playable uh, Radiophobia so far has been really good. I've been really enjoying it. Um, 
it is uh, probably going to be janky uh y'all are not maybe not prepared for how janky it's going to be compared to some of the games i usually play where is this person why are they like not here um okay uh all right, let, let's see if there's any other quests i can take i might try and clear out that bandit den because it's been pending for a little while it says difficulty hard so it's i i, I believe them we could try and get the Corsia. Let's um let's try and buy some food. If if they are still only selling perch, then I'm gonna learn how to cook perch. They are still only selling perch. Is there any could I learn how to cook chicken? I hate learning how to cook because it really is a waste of a knowledge point, but like seriously, food problems are a lot right now. We could learn how to cook pork. Oh, mutton. That could be good. Are they selling mutton? They are selling mutton. Perfect. Uh, let's let's learn how to cook mutton. Can we steal it? Sixty to one hundred. Uh, was oh, actually we could steal the perch. Maybe. Forty-five to seventy-five. The perch is worth less than the mutton. I don't understand that. I, as you were saying, Neville, it's kind of weird. Cancel. All right, we'll just buy some mutton. I'm just gonna buy all the mutton, and then we're gonna learn how to cook mutton, and we're eating mutton for a while. Uh, feet makers. Your companions are ready to d fight and shine with glory on the battlefield and make an OnlyFans account. What? I could learn cannibalism. Something about that doesn't sit with me. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna learn how to make mutton. And we have enough salt. We're all good. We're actually good for food. I don't understand. Okay, we, we should... I haven't cooked the mutton yet, so that's there's that part. Um, but... Dang. Maple is acting like mutton is some dirty, cheap, oh, sheep meat. <laughs> Zero delay stream is amazing. Thanks, Pimple. No worries. Thanks for uh, letting me uh, restart the stream. Okay, we're going to go and we're going to try and take care of this uh, bandit camp that's been pressing for a while. Unless the overhaul is clean, then it's all right. I love overhaul mods, but I'd rather make my mod pack personally. Um, it's, it is clean, uh, Andrino. I, I'm pretty sure it's not really a mod pack so much as it is basically a standalone. The reason I picked radi Radiophobia is it looked to me to be a pretty faithful adaptation or mod pack. Um, it's not so much a collection of mods as it is like its own thing in its own engine. We're going to get some ore. Did really well there. I got an iron ruby. Is there anything else? Doesn't look like it. Okay, um, so we're gonna go to this bandit lair. This is probably... I'm gonna save. This could very easily wipe out the entire team if I'm not careful. Uh, what I need to do is wipe out bandit groups near, near the, uh, the camp itself to, to, um, make it a little bit more vulnerable. There's one there. I think. We'll stay and see what stalker is like when you play. Nice. I don't think it'll be too scary. There's some eerie stuff in it. Like one of the things I like about the stalker series is it's not meant to be a horror game so much as it is meant to be like kind of 
I wouldn't even say spooky. It's it's just like a it's very atmospheric. Um, the 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 land of Stalker is is almost it feels more real than a lot of games that I've played. Um, even the janky version I'm playing, it, it just it, you know it feels like it's rooted in a reality uh, that a lot of like AAA games aren't for me personally. Um, okay, so we're gonna I'm gonna engage this bomber over here. This is actually gonna create a choke point, which is good It should anyway I need to engage this bomber as quick as possible And with that extra valor point we're gonna go ahead and use protection <laughs> uh, Nevelina Nevelina has really good armor. So I am... Oh, okay. Nevelina is going to take the brunt of this. I was actually going to engage this guy with Nevelina, so this works out for me as well. Uh, where's Porlay? I put Porlay in the worst spot, but it's actually going to work out fine. I'm going to move him over here, and we're going to go ahead and... Um, Actually, can I... I don't have any more movement. I was wondering... No, I can't reach those guys at all. Okay, we're going to go ahead and hit this guy and then get some more Valor. You don't need to use protection when you're already engaged, silly bimple. So that guy... A cactus is bleeding, which is no good. Um, this raider is next to attack. I'm going to go ahead and surround this guy. Because I just, I like, I, I think it's always a good idea to take someone out, like, focus someone and take them out as quickly as possible. This guy's going to have to do targeting. And the reason, the other reason I use Granoff to do that is because uh, Granoff isn't going to be in combat with this person. They're not um, engaged. And that means that, uh, that means that he can run away from that target. There we go. That was nice. Um, okay, well, I would love to do more with uh, Nevelina, but unfortunately, poor Lay is in the way. This combat's going very well so far. Uh, Mimi, this is a great position for Mimi. Um, I'm going to actually, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put her over here. Because uh, this guy is the only one who could maybe do some harm on Cactus. I'm going to put her over here and I'm going to aim her at an attack this way. And hopefully this guy, he, with only one target to go for, she's, he's going to go over to Mimi and aim a shot. She'll be able to execute her shot on him and then walk out of the way. So that'll be really good. You absolute jerk. I cannot believe you right now. I cannot believe you right now. <laughs> what an absolute jerk. Uh, Mimi can't get to anywhere else. Oh, God. Well, uh, it's fine. You know, <laughs> this is what happens when I try and think big brain. I'm just gonna like do a drive by and then run o run over here. It's gonna be good. Okay, um, I'm just gonna continue. Whoops, wailing on this guy. Oh my god, what is in the way? Poor Lay, you are like such a problem. Okay, stab. And we can actually kill this guy, so let's do that. So too, it's too bad I can run over to this henchman. Oh, this is a nice shot right here. Look at that. That's perfect. Ow. You got crit. 
But he engaged with Granoff, which is great because we get extra port, um, uh, valor for that. We're going to do a encouragement. So we get some extra protection. We'll just do a normal attack. Uh, yeah, I don't need extra protection. His real name is Aldrian. Alucard it reverses Dracula. I'm still not believing it. Believe it, son. You better start believing in bad alliteration devices because you're in one. Okay, time to block this guy completely from escaping and then uh, set up an attack on him. Seven damage, that's fine. Wow, Nevelina got really kind of um, blocked this match. Um, I'm going to go ahead. I kind of want to just like wail on this guy. This guy is ripe for capture. We could capture him. Nah, let's just kill him. I don't know. No, that, that, that wastes some valor. We don't need to do that. Oh, shoot. Cactus is bleeding, right? I forgot about that. Okay, I need to do some nice damage on this guy. Nevelina is actually going to get to do some stuff. Let's have her try and capture this dude. He should be pretty ripe. 83%. That's nice. His full name is Adrian Fahrenheit Tepes. Is actually... Help miss jib in reverse. Yo, you, you did it. And now we have to live with it. Um, I guess we're stuck with Mimi right now. I'm going to move her slightly down so she doesn't get hit by that attack again. And then set up an attack and then uh, move this, move Cactus out of the way. Oh, Cactus already moved? Is it just poor lay then? Ooh, nice crit from poor lay. Excellent. We can still get some extra valor by moving over here. All oh, right, he's bleeding though. Uh, might be able to kill this guy. Oh, I, I mean, we for sure can. Oh, I, I guess I could have ended it there. Mimi smash! <laughs> He pronounces gif as jif, doesn't he? Who does? Me? I don't do that. Cactus has leveled up. Cactus is a level four protector now. Um, I would, uh, he's got a good constitution, but that's not on the table right now. Let's do strength again. I'm sorry. I'm very boring about these things. You do Bimpo. You pronounce, uh, Elpimus. Was it? Well, that's Jib. G-I-B is Jib. Isn't it? Like, I like the cut of his Jib. I don't pronounce I don't pronounce gif as jif. Listen, I didn't I didn't uh, decide on the English language, you know, like it was kind of thrust upon me. And uh, you know, I won't say I I, lar I largely do not like the English. So gif is jif. No. <laughs> no. No, I don't I don't have to I, I do not have to abide by that rule actually. 
if you're trying to apply consistency onto the ling English language, I have very bad news for you. <laughs> if you're trying to apply any logic and at all to the to the matter, you're like, well, if it's pronounced this way, yeah. What about fish? Right. We all know about fish. I'm not talking about F I S H. I'm talking about P H E T I. Fish. Um. There's no consistency or logic to the English language. I'm sorry. It's a mess. Okay, we're going to cook some mutton. Cook some mutton. Medium rare mutton. Cook it all up. So delicious. It's going to eat up. Mutton delicious. Yummy, yum, yum. Look at that mutton. Now we have... Two days of food. It feels like a not a lot. Um, there we go. Must consume meat or fish at every meal. This stupid prisoner is actually like I feel like le letting him free because he's actually like a problem for me. It's fine. We're not, I'm not gaining extra valor. I'm just gaining extra happiness. So I don't mind short changing them a little bit. I gained 15 influence from all of that. That's all good. Mimi has something to say. The world is much bigger than I anticipated. It feels like I could spend my life traveling and still never visit the same place twice. Daydream gets to valor and bottle it up. I don't understand. What is Cactus's problem? <laughs> He's like, oh, that's uh, that's really nice and insightful and, and uh, you know, positive. What you should do is make that into a negative. Make that horrible for yourself. And also at the cost of two valor. Chat about it. Gets plus one relationship with close companions. I don't know who Mimi's close companions are. Sis is... Sis the fish. Kiss the fish. Never apologize for exploring our... our PG mechanics, Bimple, let the mouth breathe at your swine. I'm not exploring the RG, R, R, oh my god, RPG mechanics, though. I'm just picking strength every time because it's big smash. Bigger number, better. Close companion with cactus. How do you, how do you tell that? I'd have to look into this. Uh, carnivorous, must consume meat or fish every meal to be satisfied. Tormentor, increases by 5% when a two-handed weapon is equipped. Chance of taking a critical hit reduced by 25%. Tough, thick skin. Mimi's got some great traits. I don't know who she's friends with. It won't tell me. I don't know how to find this out. Colorblind. Mimi is squatting. Mimi's only companion is her tea mug. Mimi, which uh, which option do you want here? Daydream or chat? Uh, endure is not an option. Oh, she sit. Chat. Unlock the trait sociable. Mimi and poor Lay's relationship has improved. And Bill. It, it's it's like a hundred percent on brand that Mimi would be good friends with Bill. That's not a criticism. That's that's just good sense. Things are going well right now. Uh, I'm going to save and I'm going to attempt this fortress. I'm not seeing any other bandits. So it might be that we're fine. Level four. Well defended. Better weaken it before launching an assault. Its occupants are probably roaming the area. I tried, though. I couldn't find them. Oh, there's one. Well, but they're... They're not the ones. Alright, I'm just gonna give it a go. We're gonna give it a shot. That's an impossible fight. You never know. You never know. Uh, maybe with a, a bit of clever tactics, we could... Turn this impossible fight into an improbable fight. I, 
I think we have a choke point here. We do have a choke point here, so we could keep a couple of people here and uh, choke this whole thing off a little bit. The one I'm mainly worried about is anyone with a bow and arrow. These guys over here. So what I might do actually is we're going to move over here. We're going to charge this down over here and then um, hopefully we can block this off and then fight them kind of one at a time. You did save though, right? I did save. Don't you worry, I did save. Okay, let's do um let's let's do this. Charge! Oh god, there's another one. <laughs> we'll engage this guy. We all we got a nice hit off. And I'm gonna do uh protection. This poacher is next. They might do some nasty damage to cactus. Oh no, they're gonna move over here. Okay. Ouch! They hit poor Lay pretty good. Oh, okay. Well, that's a problem. They've engaged Nevelina. Um, poor Lay. I need to find this guy over here. Where are they? <laughs> At them there. So now this is a, a kind of a problem. Oh my god. Okay. Loading time. Listen. I don't make the rules, but if I take, uh, if someone's like dying on the first phase, then, uh, we're, that's, that's a load. Ignore everyone and daydream about slaughter like Kevpo. <laughs> I mean, uh, you know, what do you, what? What do you mean? See, this is this is why I get frustrated at this game. I did save before we entered here. This was the auto save. There's no other auto save. So that means we're stuck in this battle now. Oh god. That's really frustrating. I don't know what we're going to do about this, to be honest. And there goes all the progress again. I saved. I'm not, I'm not, you can roll it back if you want, but I saved. And I don't appreciate this game. Uh, picking and choosing when the auto save feature works and when it doesn't work. But yeah, no, now, uh, now this is an ordeal. Uh, Nevelina poisoned in the first round also means they will probably die. Um, return to last village. You know what I'm going to do? Let's... Let's see how far back that is. Rock fun, boom fart with the reverb noise. What the hell? Oh, you know what I need? I need some nice, uh, yeah. Okay, we hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, it's actually not as bad as as all that. We lost one battle. We lost one combat, which was the co one combat I did in the mountains, um, because I still have the mutton right now. So not honestly a big deal. Uh, I'm gonna head over here instead to the border crossing. We'll see what what that amounts to. And uh, I'm, we're pretty much, I'm, I'm going to wrap up War Tales pretty soon. Oh my god. 
<laughs> what the hey I love that so much yeah sorry it's gone now but this is the uh when some when times are tough you gotta you gotta press the good music button can we move across the continent one of these streams to get a feeling for viable trade routes we absolutely can the problem is i never have enough money to get to these border crossings Professor uh, Herman. I'm Professor Herman. It is my honor to represent the great universi universities of Alder Idren, Alazar, and Gozenberg. According to our information, we share a common interest in discovery and knowledge. Our learned deans have therefore selected you for a mission of crucial importance, recovering an artifact. This item is currently in the hands of the church, but the clergy refuses to send it to us for research, despite our many requests. I am sure you will agree this is unacceptable. We have therefore sought to determine the exact whereabouts of this mysterious relic, and we know now, now we now know where it is. The artifact is kept in the crypt of St. Elior Abbey. You will need to enter the church, take the relic, and bring it back to us. Conversion oil. Yay. Here, take this marble piece. Our source assured that you will need it. It's a puzzle piece. Um, Gossenberg Merchant Gawick. Sorry, guys. I meant Jawick. Can we steal? Just curious, if you bought Y2K, would you play it relatively soonish before the next big update, or is your playlist full? My playlist is pretty full. Um, like, I'm kind of maintaining five or six different games right now, because it's War Tales, Weird West, uh, Spiritfarer, Mutation, um, now potentially Stalker, if people are willing to tolerate that. Um, I would play it. Uh, I wasn't going to buy it because it's not on sale. Um, but yeah, I, I, I like it really is up to you, y'all. Like if, if there's something y'all really want me to play, I'd be happy to do that. Like, uh, you know, I'm, I'm willing to accommodate if I can. So what's your deal? How much are you going to charge me? Fleeing our, uh, Arthas, are you going there? 200 border pass. God damn it. Well, there you go, Neville. I can't afford it. I cannot afford it. I could, you know what? If I sell like literally everything I have on me right now, maybe. All right. All right, lads and and lass. Uh, I'm going to save. I really wish there was a save as option or, you know. No pressure. I was just curious. Um, I have no qualms with playing Y2K. It sounds like a wonderful mess. Um, but yeah. Venturing time. Here you go, you absolute jerk. Very well. At your own risk, the border is now op is open to you in both directions you know. Should you regret your boldness, you can return to Tiltrin without paying. Yay. I'm gonna say it. I don't care if you broke your elbow. I don't have that on my soundboard and, you know, to my great regret. Country of Arthas, Kingdom of Adoran. We made it, lads. We have made it. And this is going to pay for itself because I actually, I have had a mission to visit Korsha for a while now and I have not been able to uh, deliver on that. This calls for some music. 
Excellent. I, I want to play this game for stream at some some point. <gasps> Is that a trapper? Oh! No, it's not. It's wolves. What the hell? <laughs> oh, what the hell? Doodly doo doo doo. Church of Saint Septimus. I bet we could get some new quests here. I don't know who we're supposed to talk to in regards to, uh, Bring the message to Korsha. New stuff. I pray each day for this war to end. He's that guy's straight out of Vinland Saga, I swear to God. That, that was a uh, Leif Erikson. This church is dedicated to Saint Septimus, the seventh son of Jeru. Is it Jeru or Geru, chat? Our guide and founder of the faith of the light. Jeru and the other saints are hallowed individuals, but they are only human. The only divine being, the eternal one who will welcome us at death's door, is the all-seeing eye. Save your dogma, honestly. Do not believe in Lord Vernalis' so-called vision for one second. Jeru came to him in a dream. How very providential. Everyone knows his mother has always dreamt of becoming a countess. Okay, well, we don't have to deliver squat here. We have to deliver a message to someone. Of course, y'all. Adoranian restoration. Uh, I gotta deliver a message. Oh, is it this person? You seem lost. Are you in need of a particular information of, of, about Arthen, or Arthas? Oh, these are all quests. Nice. Inform. You have just completed the mission. Inform Korsha. Hope you didn't open it. I never did. Let's steal some information. Uh, I can steal this stuff? Doesn't let me. Can we take any new quests here? Collect bounty. Yo, let's go. Responsible. Oh, wow. I have a bunch of hand ins. Oh, no, these are these are quests to complete. We're not doing rat infestation. Uh, loot bandits lair. That's hard. Some people were spotted looting corpses on a battlefield. This must not be allowed to continue. Average. Um, I'll accept an average quest. We'll do negotiate at 60%. Refuses, okay. I hate that you lose the influence, like, as well. Um, but it is what it is. Let's also do Vanquish the Vivius Gang. And I'll negotiate a little bit. Wow. Absolutely rude. I just spent 40 influence for nothing. What's the local cuisine? Pork stew. Recipe pork stew. Two pork, beans, salt. Where do we get beans? Um, we have enough money to pay our dues, and that is the important thing. And I think that's a good place to leave War Tales for today. I'll have a quick look at the market. Who do we got going on over here? May the all-seeing eye strike me down if I lie. I saw him, I swear, three days ago. I was collecting firewood with my husband when the hunter's ghost attacked us. We managed to flee to the mountains, but it was a, was a very close call. Okay. Uh, don't believe a word she says. She probably came across a band of deserters. 
they have been running up rampant in these parts since the beginning of the war. So now that we are in Croatia or Corsia, um, we can start con like actually considering trade routes. Um, the problem with trade routes is that it takes about a day to travel between um, them. So I'd have to be able to spend enough money to make it worthwhile. Um, this is where recipes are come in handy. I mean, like, you can definitely argue that recipes are not necessarily worth it because um, you have to spend knowledge points. And I get that, but they do um, really highly cut down on your uh, food costs. So, like, now we can look at, um, we could buy a bunch of carp. Um, and I am actually just going to buy all of this carp because that's really nice. And... Uh, we have enough salt for all of... Actually, we don't because we have 10 mutton as well. So I'm going to make sure I have 21 salt. And I'm going to sell some other things to make sure that I have enough to pay everyone. Don't worry. Sell this comfrey. All right. Beans! We can buy beans here. Ah, I could have learned the recipe actually kind of tempting we don't have any pork but um i could get pork but i don't know the recipe is 80 coins even on sale that's i don't know a little bit a little bit dicey anyway we're gonna call it here this is a good place to call it we got some quests that seem a bit more doable i wonder if there's a uh do you think there's a prison over here find the artifact hidden in saint elor abbey um there's a few things we can do. If I can find a prison, um, then I can hand in my prisoner. So there's that. And uh, yeah. War Tales. War Tales, honestly, turning, uh, things are turning around a little bit. I say that every time, but things have been turning around a little bit every single time. Hunting the Gobos, and apparently Gobos is pronounced Jabos according to Bimple. <laughs> Never said this. Chasing croc dude intensifies. All right, chat. I'm going to take a, a quick minute to go make some coffee.